On behalf of the State Duma Committee on Labor, Social Policy and Veterans Affairs, it is with great pleasure that I welcome all the guests, all the participants, all the organizers of the International Congress. This is not the first event that unites people of all ages, nationalities and faiths, but everyone is united by a single life principle, the development of the spiritual world. As a child, studying at art school, I remember with what pleasure I always leafed through the album of Rarex paintings, they impressed these mountains, they inspired, they encouraged me to draw. I also loved mountains, I loved nature, I loved painting, and somehow it all reminds me of those childhood moments, that carelessness, that lightness, that calmness, which, unfortunately, today, is clearly not enough for all of us. The issues of the spiritual and moral world, the issues of strengthening, formation and development of spiritual potential, this is what is at the epicenter of your attention, and I believe that together we can change the world for the better. It was with great pleasure that I visited the Rarick Museum a few years ago and at the same time immersed myself in the atmosphere in which Nikolai Konstantinovich arrived, organizing his visit, his journey, scientific journey, research trip to the East. I have watched a lot of documentaries and I understand firsthand. I know who H. P. Blavatsky is, and what role the Rorik spouses played in the spiritual and moral development, strengthening, and formation of science. There is also a memorable place in the Smolensk region that reminds us of Nicholas Rarik and his work. I wish everyone success, interesting conversations, interesting discussions, interesting meetings, interesting acquaintances, and in this difficult time I wish all of us a peaceful sky over our heads. The doors of the Committee on Labor, Social Policy and Veterans Affairs are always open and we must work together to solve the task set for our society, for our country, especially if it concerns the spiritual and moral world, spiritual and moral values, and the need to create the necessary legal legislative, legislative platform for strengthening and for development, for the improvement of all our citizens.